You're not my dad. Do you mean she passed dad would soon over this? My dad has paid for everything for me. And remind you of it every day. Now you're selling your soul and calling it financial independence? My soul? Give it a break, Turk. You're opening yourself up to some scary stuff, Sheila. At least let me check into him first. Six months as a part-time news stringer, and you think you're Anderson Cooper? This is no joke, Sheila. You don't know who these people are. I care about you, OK? And I don't like that you're going to be watched 24-7. I mean, what am I going to see? There it is. You say you care about me, but it's all about you. Uh, medium coffee and croissant. Uh, actually, could you just make that a uh, medium coffee? It looks like you're leaving regardless. Not by choice. What do they do to her? You tell me. Hey, I'm not a scientist. But I am. And you're holding back. I don't want to upset her anymore. Would you rather her be hurt or dead? It's like the accident didn't even happen. That's not normal. What? What do you know? The way I read it, they introduced a novel protein into the sperm receptor of the egg. With the genetically engineered chromosomes. So what happened to them? They survived. 23 years and counting. Emily! Emily, I need to talk to you. Please! <laughs> it's Paul. It's your husband. Emily, please just come outside. Hey, shithead, why don't you leave her alone, huh? This is my house. Yeah? I live here. Yeah, a piece of this? Yeah, Julie, I'm gonna need a little bit more time to readjust. Bullshit. Stop acting like a ten-year-old, Elmore. What do you want me to do? Get your act together, get yourself checked, and get back to your work, goddammit, instead of spending our money on God knows what. We'll go back to work tomorrow. And what about the hospital? I'm not going to the hospital. Why? Give me one good reason. Because I'm scared, all right? Please, 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 please.